Art is not meant to please. Art is not meant to entertain. Art is not meant to adorn your sitting room. Art is not an ornament. The purpose of real art is to make you think, to wonder, to speculate, to make you aware of things by revealing truths hidden from your perception. My main inspirations in painting come from worlds beyond worlds of cosmos, visible or invisible, sensed by our physical senses or reached by the mind and imagination. Space kindles my imagination, but my paintings comprise music and poetry expressed in colors and shapes. Like a music composer, writes, uh, composes uh, melodic sounds, I compose colors and shapes. Often my paintings are poetic allegories delivering a message to the spectator. Art, and especially painting, is an ecstasy, a vehicle carrying the Creator into worlds unknown, unfolding areas of cosmos unseen by the ordinary mind and eye. Painting is a science delving deep into the unknown, bringing to light truths and possible worlds that put one's mind into motion. The painter is a poet from the Greek word pio, which means create. So, the painter is a creator. The painter is a poet. My work is divided into units. Uh, two units are the most important for me. Uh, the unit Cosmos and the Blood unit. These are the Blood series paintings. In all these paintings I want to express the spilling of innocent, mainly innocent, Blood. I call this painting the slaughtered and I want to express again as in all these uh, blood series the, the, the spilling of blood, the, the, the slaughtering of the innocent. The white shirt represents innocence and here we have the atrocious murder in general of the innocent, whether it is people, innocent people, and innocent animals, as I talk in my painting, Earth, the Slaughterhouse Planet. I call this painting Earth, the Slaughterhouse Planet, wanting to bring attention to the fact that innocent blood is spilled unfairly on this planet. People's blood and animals' blood. Being an animal advocate, I became aware of the fact that billions of animals are slaughtered every day to feed the carnivorous humans. People's blood is spilled Take, for example, in Syria, in Iraq, and many, in, many, in many other countries. This, the blood of the innocent, is gushing out of this planet and runs in streams. And this 
I became aware of and uh, it has really caused me a lot of disturbance. A glass of red wine lifted against the sun as the sun sets behind the mountain the, it creates sparkles like red diamonds and this I call red wine sparkles in the sunlight. This painting was selected and exhibited in the Art Monaco April uh, 2014 and it is again selected and will be exhibited in Paris at the Grand Palais Exhibition. The, the title of the art show is Open Art Code Paris in November 2014. This is Eros emerging from chaos. And I painted this uh, picture, uh, wanting to bring uh, an optimistic message, the symbol of life, the creator, the, the one who uh, dispels chaos and brings harmony, uh, coming out from chaos. Uh, this is an optimistic, uh, a hopeful uh, message the world and this is the reason I painted this painting and Eros is uh, depicted in this uh, young man almost conventional in a way This painting and this painting uh, will be exhibited in the Vienna exhibition in August 2014. Uh, the art show is called uh, The Spirit of Art Returns to Vienna. The title of this painting is Running Out of Time. And the title of this painting is called a blue storm. This is Muja. In Greek, Muja is the uh, the open pan in this position expressing indignation, anger, and very often it is a curse. I was inspired to paint this painting in 2011 when the Greek people took the, to the streets and to the Constitution Square in Athens demonstrating against uh, austere measures outside the House of Parliament and thousands of people were extending their hands and arms pointing to the House of Parliament like that. It was a very impressive spectacle and I was inspired by that and Muja, I may say, is our national gesture our national symbol of indignation, anger and curse. I call this painting Cosmic Ejaculation and it is really a spermatic explosion of life.
far in space, in the constellation of Hercules, there is a great cluster of stars, like diamonds. And I was inspired by this phenomenon, and I painted this painting, and it is really, its title is The Great Cluster in Hercules. It was selected and exhibited in the Biennale in London, uh, 2013, and the La Galleria Gallery in London. This is Cosmos Synthesis One. It was selected and exhibited at the Biennale of the Arts Museum in Canzano, Italy, September 2013. This painting is called The Big Bang and the Creation of the Planets. The London Arts Guardian uh, selected this painting and posted it in their site for promotion. I call this painting gold. It's an acrylic gold paint. And this painting is selected and will be exhibited at the Palermo Biennale and Florence in Italy in January, February and March 2015. You may not see, you may not hear, you may not know, but the poet sees, the poet hears, the poet knows.